Today we're going to talk about why you should explain your procedures in depth on your website. My name is Michael Roberts and I work with P3. One of the questions that we hear oftentimes is what kind of content should go on my website? And once we get past the basic information of, you know, of course, information about your practice, who the physicians are, who the surgeons are, all of that sort of information, one of our strong recommendations is to make sure that you're putting information about your procedure. And this fulfills two main goals. The, the main goals that we're trying to take care of are, first of all, the patient experience. The patient needs to know what to expect when they're coming in, and we'll talk more about that in just a second. And the other side of it is your marketing and your search engine optimization needs. The more that we can be thorough about how you perform your procedures, what patients should expect, what that experience is like, the more that we can help Google and help patients. So let's dig into this concept of the patient experience. The, the clearer that you can be about the information that you're displaying on your website, when you're talking about, again, the procedures that you use, it solves a variety of needs. So one reason that it helps is that we are seeing, of course, more and more educated patients. There are patients that care about whether you're doing an anterior approach to your hip replacement or a superior approach. And, you know, take that to any other procedure that you might be using. Patients are doing research on this kind of information and they're finding out um, what matters most for them. And it this isn't going to be all of your patients, of course, but some of your patients are going down this pathway. Another Another reason that we really want to be very thorough in this information is that we want to put patients at ease, whether they know exactly which approach they want on the type of uh, surgical incision or whether they're just trying to understand what's going on. The goal here is to help your patients relax, help them understand what's happening with this. And a big part of that is what's going on with your post-surgical expectations. Am I going to be expecting ongoing bleeding? What kind of discomfort am I going to face? What's going to happen? when I wake up at two in the morning and I've got questions and I can go to the website and I can answer them, okay, now I'm breathing easy, now I'm all right with this process and I don't have to worry about running into the ER or taking care of you know some sort of drastic steps to, to make sure that I'm just all right. This is information that can be easily relayed and can easily help soothe patients al along the way. So that's the patient experience side of things. And then think about it from a marketing perspective. Think about it from what Google is using to understand your, your practice and what it is that you do, how you perform these procedures, why they should show you in search results more often. So the more information you, you display there in a way that's easily understandable, again, keep the patient in mind. They don't have the medical degree that you do uh, or that your surgeons do in your practice. So let's put it out there in very easily understandable language but that not only, again, helps the patient, it also helps Google understand. And then what happens is that you get this chance to talk about how you work with your patients specifically. What makes you as a practice or as a surgeon different than the practice that's just down the road? And the more you talk about that, the more it helps patients and, and search engines understand which is the right option for them. So one of the things that we like to really encourage uh, practices to do is to make sure that they're including a lot of like local information. So if you know you're in Boise and you want to talk about how you know making sure that you get out and you exercise after surgery as soon as you can, as soon as it's appropriate, all that fun stuff. But going to the local parks, going to the malls that are nearby to walk, whatever that that right you know post surgical rehab is right for them. Making sure that we're talking about those sorts of things, talking about the local. Um, the local environment there, the local town to help, again, kind of tie this all together. Not only is this surgeon the right surgeon for you, this surgeon is located in this area, and this surgeon knows um, what your options are after surgery. So these are some basic ways, and you know we go in a lot more depth when we work with, work, work with our clients on this kind of information, but these are basic ways that you can start thinking about how you can help your patients and how you can help Google better understand and the other many other systems that are out there starting to index this kind of information. So as always, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us at here at P3. We're happy to help. Thanks so much.